Hey, what's going on, guys? It's your boy, Night Phase. Blu-ray Tuesday. I know, I've been slacking. I promise I'll pick up this title. And I'm so excited. I got a good copy. Um, I have the worst luck when it comes to Target exclusives. I always get the package, and then there's something wrong with it, like The Last Jedi. It was just a big crimp in the front. It drove me crazy. But uh, I made sure you know, to check it. As soon as I paid for it, I checked it. And there was some box damage, and the lady was cool, and whatever. She got me a brand new copy. You know, so I'm super excited. I love Black Panther. It's crazy. It broke box office records. It's still in theaters. It's just so amazing. I could go on how much I love this film. Uh, you know, just how they integrated the African culture in MCU film was so fascinating to me. That cast is amazing. Especially the females here, Lupita Nyong'o, Denai Gurra from Walking Dead, all great, and of course one of the best MCU villains. You got uh, Michael B. Jordan as Eric Killmonger, just crushed it. But enough of that. Here it is, the Target exclusive. <sighs> look, look at this beauty. And don't get me wrong, I was dying for that Best Buy Steelbook. Unfortunately. It opened till 10. I work graveyard. This works out better for me. I might double dip. I don't know. I try not to double dip, but man, that steel book at Best Buy, it has like this vibranium finish. So that's pretty cool. But this Target exclusive is, is great too. And I like what I like about it so much is it's very it's thin. It's not like thick uh, like the Coco Target exclusive. You know, it's not too oversized. Uh, they really really put a lot of thought into this packaging so if you go for a target exclusive you're you're not getting a bad exclusive at all you're getting a really nice package just that iconic shot of a uh, wakanda so cool uh you see t'challa there standing there right next to the black panther statue so cool they blended like sci-fi elements with uh, like an african tribe oh my god so there you have it um, you got some details. You got the J card right here. You know, um, got a b bunch of uh, bonus features, which is cool. Meet the king, the king of Wakanda. <laughs> I just, I love their accent. I wish I could do it so well to do it justice how they talk. You know, get this man his shield. Well, that's Infinity War, but <laughs> you know, like I said, oh Shuri, Shuri's my favorite. I love Shuri. Absolutely adore her character. But yeah. Sorry, I know I'm just you just want to get to the target exclusive. We, we're getting there, guys. All right, sorry, I just I I love this movie so much. I can't wait to rewatch it finally. Just look at that, just great um, shots that they utilize here in this packaging. Oh my god, look at that! So freaking cool, man. Just again, look, look, so beautiful. <laughs> I'm gonna shed a tear. I'm gonna shed a tear. All right, here we go. So it comes off. Oh, look at that! Look at that. T'Challa himself, the King of Wakanda. You know. Yeah, Chadwick Boseman was great. I mean, I loved the entire cast. It was amazing. Amazing. It was like near perfect for me. It's one of my. It's definitely top ten MCU films. Um, my God. And of course, Michael B. Jordan as Eric Killmonger. Such a fascinating uh, villain. He was number one to me, but you know, Thanos uh, topped him, but he's a close second. But man, it just, you really understand his motives, why he's doing the things he does. And you can also argue the fact that he's not really a villain, you know? It's, I'm super sympathetic to what he goes through in this film, his journey, why, you know. He's doing the things that he does. And man, just, he added so many layers that could have just been a throwaway, typical, bland MCU villain, you know, because they haven't broken off that trope. But man, he really, just really lended so much to this character. You know, that, that line, that line he says at the end, um, you know, you should have seen the movie already. It's just a line, people, so don't come at me with oh, spoilers. You just spoiled it. Yeah, plenty of time, because I, I got some... I ain't going to name... No names, but, you know, Last Jedi. 
uh, unboxing I did, like, oh, you spoiled something. It was something minor. It wasn't even... Anyway, you should have seen the movie by now, but that line he says, you're like, bury me in the ocean with my ancestors was... Whoa. So deep. So deep. But, yeah. Okay, here we go. Now we're into the inside artwork. And I love that, giving praise to the ladies. Okoye. I love Okoye. She was... God, it's, it's a toss-up between Shuri and Okoye. I love Okoye. And I love Lupita Nyong'o's character, Nakia, right? She's uh, T'Challa's love interest. You get the um, Blu-ray, you know, the blue disc. And I wish they had that inside artwork like um, the 4K. The 4K uh, disc had. Because you know, I saw it on Best Buy. But look at that. Just look at that. So badass. I like her character as well. With her uh, size, no, not that size, those discs she has. That weaponry is pretty cool. Uh, I think it comes with a booklet and does come with a digital copy. Alright. Oh, sweet. Uh, you know, this, this packaging is perfect for me. But just, just a minor nitpick, I would have loved to see Sherry here. Not Nothing against Lupita Nyong'o's character. But, you know, I love Shuri. If Shuri was here, it would have been perfect. But it's still near perfect. It's like a 95%. <laughs> I degrade this package. And I'm really happy with it. Um, here's the booklet it comes with. Sweet. Look at that shot. Uh, Black Panther versus Eric Killmonger. In their Panther suits. So awesome. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Oh, <laughs> look at that artwork. The king is here. Also, I love Umbaku. Um, his character was great. Hoo-ah! Like like that war cry he does is so badass. He's like, don't want to. We will not eat you. We're vegetarians. <laughs> I just... God, I absolutely fell in love with their culture in this movie. It's so cool. I wish Wakanda was a real place. There's my girl, Sherry! Sorry. <laughs> Wakanda. I gotta do it. You ready? Wakanda forever. Sorry. I had to. I had to, okay? Look at that. Look at this uh, photo gallery. You just got, you know, you got, um, the Wakanda alphabet. Cool. You can learn to speak Wakanda, and then we could just, you know, go in there, warn them about Thanos. Uh, well, maybe it's too late, but. <laughs> oh, man. Just look at that. Look. Those rhinos were cool, though. Those rhinos were dope. Wish they showed up in uh, said film, you know. But, um, there you have it. Gauntlets. That's pretty cool. Ikea. Man, this Target exclusive, I'm telling you. So happy. I, You know, I was like, oh, man. This book looks so cool. Let, let this Target exclusive be good. And it is. I'm... Super satisfied. I may not have to double dip. I don't know, but it's still tempting. Oh, man. Look at the concept art. It's so freaking cool. So cool, man. This, and just, I love how, like, glossy this booklet is. It's so, it's like, smooth texture, man. Like, what? They put a lot of thought into this. I really love this. I like his new suit. Got that purple glowing effect. So cool, man. My God, look at that. Look at that, man. One of the best MCU films. One of the best. Um, gotta go through the whole thing. But there you have it. An amazing gallery book. I really like this. This is one of the better Target exclusive. Holy crap, I'm so satisfied. So if you guys want the Target exclusive, definitely go out and seek it. You can't go wrong. Both packagings are mwah, perfection. Seriously. They're both great. Um, so put the desk back in there. So yeah, you got that blue. That's the only thing I wish it had that disc art that the steel book had. Because if you get the steel book from Best Buy, you you get that. You get that awesome disc art, which is always great. I like when they, you know, it just makes the whole package feel so uh, complete when they put in that, you know, disc art. Just makes the world a better place <laughs> so again amazing shot inside 
amazing shot of the villain and the hero, or from Killmonger's perspective, the villain and the hero. Interesting, see? But yeah, there you have it, guys. That is the Black Panther Target exclusive. I guess you call this like a digibook, digipack, whatever. It's it's just great. It's an awesome exclusive. It's the right size. <sighs> Perfectly balanced. <laughs> but yeah, uh, post your comments down below. Let me know which exclusive you're going to get. Are you going to get the Steelbook from Best Buy? Are you going to get this one from Target? Um, what do you think about the movie? Comment down below. Let me know your rating. What's your favorite uh, movie moment in Black Panther? Who was your favorite character? Uh, yeah, let me know. Uh, make sure you subscribe. If you're new to my channel, give this video a like. It always helps. And I'll catch you the next one.